a rainbow Christmas tree. Yes, today we are going to be creating a rainbow Christmas tree with these cakes. I'm excited about this, so let's get started. Now to create this Christmas tree, look at that. I'm using store-bought cakes, and originally I was just gonna do this as like a $20 store-bought cake challenge, and it would have been possible because the bottom layer is 10, the two cakes on top are five each, um, but I wanted my Christmas tree to be a little bit taller, so I'm adding these muffins to the top. And they were a dollar each, so about like $24, not too bad. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm just going to flatten out the top of my cake and I really wanted to do this with chocolate cake. That's kind of like what I felt like eating with my coffee. But I didn't realize that the bottom layer is German chocolate cake and I don't like any of that coconut nonsense that they got. But my mom does, so she's probably gonna be eating that layer. So we got the two $5 cakes. Then I'm adding three muffins, coating them with chocolate buttercream, the buttercream that I took off the cake and voila. We got our cake stacked and it's time to start carving our triangle shape. Now once I was happy with the shape, I started to crumb coat the sides. I'm using white buttercream because I know that the colors on the outside of this cake are going to be very bright and light and I wanted to mask some of the chocolate. And then I started to decorate. Now the color scheme that I got, this is the color scheme that I have in one of my rainbow gardens on Animal Crossing. <laughs> it's a really nice garden and I was like, oh this would be a really cool color scheme for a Christmas tree and I was right. So we got like a violet, a baby blue, we have this really soft green, yellow, and orange, and then a very light coral pink. Each of these colors is being added to the cake with three different tips just so that my Christmas tree has a lot of different textures. And this is a funny part because I started without my hat and then I realized that I wasn't wearing a hat. <laughs> <laughs> I put it on. Now we got some sixlets, gumballs, and I made these tiny candy canes as well as gingerbread men and a fondant. I added my Christmas star and voila, my Christmas tree was complete. Now I did add a white ribbon as a last minute addition. I think it looks really nice and separates the colors well. And I didn't add too much detail because I really wanted to highlight this rainbow. Oh my god, look at those gingerbread men. I made each one by hand. Now I hope you guys are having a happy holiday, as happy a holiday as you can be right now. I think this might be my last Christmas cake because I want to make an Ahsoka cake next and a Wonder Woman cake since her movie is going to be released on Christmas Day. I love you guys. Stay safe. I will see you very soon. Peace.